Well, who of your ego state has been in the driver's seat lately? Rolf gave you some examples in his last podcast and invited you to observe yourself. How did it go? What did you notice about yourself? What came in your mind? Spontaneously, a saying has come to my mind, nevertheless, it does move. Welcome to the Emotional Connectivity Podcast of Talent Management Academy. Legend has it that this saying, nevertheless, it does move, has been attributed to Galileo Galilei when leaving the Inquisition court muttering to himself. This really ingenious scientist obviously was always on the move all his life and provided us with epoch-making findings in mechanics, physics and astronomy. Even if you are not such an ingenious innovator or researcher, by the way, nor am I, it is quite evident that if you move, you will start other movements because, figuratively speaking, movement is contagious. What about you? How agile are you? In Corona times, sitting in your home office at the desk and your neck is increasingly tensed up, you may know this situation. You shall finish the presentation until tomorrow and you can't stop to chew it over and over so that you are starting to seriously believe that you can't do it today. On the spur of the moment you decide to go out catching fresh air and go for a walk. After you return to your desk, the presentation is done in no time because your physical activity has also moved your thoughts. Movement is a real energy booster driving you to act. It's not a must to train for the Olympics. Walking fast every day helps to improve your performance and your stamina, which has a positive impact on creativity and problem solving. You won't get tired that quickly. Now imagine you would have the task to win new customers. You have no clue how to manage it and that you only copy and paste what others would do would never be an option you think. And how about turning upside down the problem? What would you have to do so that customers would be scared away anyway? If you then take the role of a disappointed customer, you will experience the change of perspective and come up with ideas that you would have never dreamed before. For next week, I would like to invite you to expand your focus. How about outdoor brainstorming in fresh air? With a person of your choice about a topic that has been actually crossing your mind? You may say finally, nevertheless, it does move. This brain block. Go ahead, move.